you did not attend to certain aspects of your life, so they will go by the tendencies that exist within you or by the social situations that are happening around you. So if you allow outside situations to simply happen the way they happen, largely it will happen to all of us reasonably the same way if you are living in the same place. You said uh, in your book, destiny is what you create for yourself, fate is when you fail to create your own destiny. I, I am a believer in responsibility. You, I heard that you don't drive through the red lights. <laughs> I've run a few red lights. <laughs> All right. But I, but again, I say, you know, if for people that say, oh, it's all fake, then I'm, I always like, I, I half jokingly say, okay, then run all the red lights, see what happens. I mean, I believe that uh, the prime mover or God, whatever, or, or light that wants our hands on the wheel, uh, saying we are, we are self-determining creatures. Don't just take the hands off and just completely inshallah the whole the the the, the whole uh, existence of going through the world um so there's a responsibility and fate i think and there's a the, the fate of responsibility and that's what is that sort of what that line saying destiny is what you create for yourself fate is when you fail to create your own destiny that would be there's a fate of I mean, fate is a fact in waiting mm -hmm. fate is a uh fate is a destiny unattended you did not attend. You did not attend. You did not attend to certain aspects of your life, so they will go by the tendencies that exist within you, or by the social situations that are happening around you. So, if you allow outside situations to simply happen the way they happen, largely it will happen to all of us reasonably the same way if you are living in the same place. But destiny means you take charge of it, and uh, though. Many times we may not be able to change all the physical situations around us, still we can change the way we experience it, nobody can stop us from that. What is your life is essentially the way you experience it. What is your life is not in terms of what you have around you. What your life really is, is the way you experience it. And the way you experience it or whichever way you experience it happens within you. What happens within you, if you don't take charge of that, I think it's a wasted life. Outside situations, not always governed by us, there are many, too many forces around us, everything is not determined by us. What we have outside right now, we were talking about technology. Well, uh, if you and me existed five hundred years ago or thousand years ago, what we could do would have been very different. So what we are doing now, let us not take too much pride in what we are doing right now, because this is a consequence of the times in which we exist. If we did exist here at ten thousand years ago, I don't know if you would have found a cave in Austin, I would have found in India <laughs> So <laughs> yeah. Yes, would have been somewhere else doing it some other yeah. way. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. what we are doing is a consequence of times, but how we experience it is entirely ours. A caveman also, there were cavemen or cave women who are joyful and miserable. Today in twenty-first century, with all the conveniences, there are joyful and miserable people still, all right? So it is the way you experience is determined by you, not by the situations around you.